So, were you able to find the answers you were looking for? You were pretty upset the last time you were here. I hope I didn't say anything that I might regret. Well, the way I remember it, uh, you were adamant about altering the prenuptial agreement, but I never received any changes, so I figured and um, I hoped that you and Andrew had worked things out. Though if you did, you probably wouldn't be here, would you? Did I mention how bad the fighting had gotten? You did. Has it gotten physical? Did I give you the impression that it had? Well, call it intuition or uh, years of experience, but I got the feeling that you were scared of your husband. I don't mean to make you uncomfortable, Siobhan. My only point is that if there's been abuse, your divorce case will be drastically different. We can certainly revisit this subject when you feel more comfortable. My office managed to track down the quick claim deed you signed for 227 Pratt Street. Uh, you may have been right that he was trying to hide the value of this particular investment. I'm sorry, could you remind me about that property again? It's a building that Andrew's company acquired. Um, this is only a Xerox copy, but from the looks of it, the date might have been changed. Which means? To be blunt, your husband's trying to cheat you. Now, if you can find the original deed, and if the date is different, you'd have a real opportunity to claim 50% of that property.